There are lots of ways to open a blind bag. So for this tutorial, we're gonna go through the six most common ways to open your blind bags. Now, the first one is you just bought your blind bag from the store, you're super excited to see if your feeling was correct or if you just grabbed it blindly, what's inside. So you get inside your car and then you have nothing else on you except for these puppies here. So all you do is you grab your hands, you get that thing, you open up the seam from the top, and you just pull that bag apart like this. And then once you've got it open, you dump those characters out and oh, it looks like for this little tutorial, we got Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz. The second way that you can open a blind bag is for those with a little more patience. And for that, you wait till you get home and you have the scissors. Now, these scissors are probably the most common way to open your blind bag. What you do is you move your contents down to the bottom so you don't cut any dress pieces like from Dorothy. And then on the back, they have this nice little picture of a scissors and a dotted line you can follow to get a nice cut, making sure that, that blind bag goes completely open. And you can go all the way across you want if you want, or if you want, you kind of leave a little dangly here so you can keep the package in better condition for resale value. But after you've opened those, that straight line with your scissors, you can dump out the contents. And for this time, it looks like we have the Tin Man from Wizard of Oz. The third way to open your blind bag is a good old handy knife. Now these Swiss Army knives I love. I always carry them on me um, because I just find them to be a very useful tool. And you know, this is not Crocodile Dundee for my older viewers. You don't need a huge knife. You just need a sharp blade that will cut along the bag. And for this, you're gonna wanna make sure you have a cutting board or something that you don't damage your table or whatever surface you're on underneath. And so for this one, once again, we get our blind bags, all the contents are down low, lay it flat. You're gonna put your fingers here away from the blade. And again, all these things, only use sharp objects for adults. Kids always get your parents' permission, but what you do is just slide that blade across the top of your blind bag, pushing down, seeing how it easily comes off, a nice straight line. And this time we're gonna open it up and it looks like we got the Scarecrow from Wizard of Oz. And in case you haven't uh, figured it out, I did actually feel these in the store to know what bags I had. The fourth way we're gonna open our blind bag here is very similar to the knife, but something that you probably have in your toolbox, which will be a straight edge razor. Now you'll notice that this razor is hidden because once again, kids do not do this at home. This is for adults only, but put it out there and you got that very, very sharp blade, that razor blade. And once again, we've got our surface to cut on so we don't damage our table, floor, or wherever we're cutting. We move the contents of the bag down hold that bag down. You know, this time I think I'll do it here so I've got that little scissor mark to kind of guide because it's the same line. We're still just going to go straight across, making sure our fingers are nowhere near the blade and hopefully no objects are. And if you've watched these other three fully, you probably have guessed that this hopefully will be the cowardly lion from the Wizard of Oz. And yes, my blind bag feeling skills are still at the top of the game. Now for those of us who aren't so handy, who don't have a toolbox laying around with straight edge razors or a knife, there's something we all probably have in common, and that is our love of pizza. So grab a pizza cutter, these fun little spinny pizza cutters. Remember, kids, this is just for adults. Don't try this at home. Ooh, pretty reflection. Cool. Anyway, let's get this pizza cutter. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna get that very sharp end of our pizza cutter. We're gonna get our blind bag, make sure all our contents are down though. We've got this cutting board here, and we're gonna go across the blind bag. And you're probably gonna have to lift it up against the blade to get that thing to cut in, because this is not a pizza, folks. This is not something very with pus. Oh, there we go. We got it open. We're gonna open it up and see what's inside. And since we're all through with our Wizard of Oz characters, I wonder what's inside our blind bag. We've got the giraffe character. How cool. The final way to open your blind bag is not simple. It takes years of dedicated study and a real dedication. But if you love it and you are honing your craft and your art, once you learn, you will always do it this way. And that is through magic. That's right, I've got my Harry Potter Lego wand here and I will use my magic spell with perfect enunciation and movement with my wrist to open this blind bag. Expecto Openus! And there we have it, Vampire Hunter Abraham Lincoln. Okay, I know it's not him, but that's what I call him. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe 
and you can click on the image to watch another video. Until next time, let's keep building together.